Hey! It's a very late and I'm very sleepy and I'm very bad at talking. So, I've had a pretty eventful week. I had all of my exams. I finished my exams. I'm so happy. Some of them, some of the like five months or whatever. Like, that's ridiculous. I went to the Arrested Development premiere yesterday, which was kind of ridiculously insane. I didn't realise that was happening. I didn't go in, but I just like saw the cast and I got a giant poster that comes, if you put it up lengthways, it comes up to about here on me. There it is. I hope Becky did well on her oral. I know those are really, really stressful. I remember. So glad I never have to do that again. I feel bad for people who are doing languages here. For example, Rachel. Thank you for your video. I finally got to stroke Grace without sneezing like a crazy person. I have a question for you. This question is from Rachel, so you can thank her. You know how in the past they rode horses? Is her exact words. I don't know if she's aware people still ride horses now. But if you could ride any animal, even if it's one that's extinct, what would it be? I thought about it. I thought some kind of dinosaur, but I was like, I have to be specific, otherwise it's just boring. Dinosaur is not a good answer. So I was like, pterodactyl? Now I know they're not technically dinosaurs, but it's about the same time. But I looked up, apparently they couldn't support human weight. They weren't that good flyers, they were mostly gliders, so no. So my answer is a triceratops. I would ride a triceratops if I could. Taller than a human, but not by much, so about a good size, I think. So that would be like ridiculous. Can you imagine just going to going to school or whatever on a triceratops? I would be so jealous, man. Yeah, so now I'm free. So now I'm gonna just spend my entire time reading and writing music and watching Game of Thrones and watching other things probably, but mostly Game of Thrones. I hope everything's going cool with work and with Becky's school and stuff. Um, and I'll see you tomorrow for the Libra concert. Oh my goodness. Bye.